New tonight, the Memphis City Council signing off tonight on a multi-million dollar project called Liberty Park. What we knew once as the Mid-South Fairgrounds growing up. There used to be a nice amusement park <laughs> there. You don't remember any of this, but I, it used to be a good time there at Mid-South Fairgrounds. Uh, so I've heard. <laughs> now the city of Memphis voted to move forward with a $13 million 30-year lease, which will be the site of new housing, hotels, even laser tag. Our Desmond Nugent is live near where the construction will begin. Now Desmond, is everyone on board with this decision? Richard Pepper, not entirely. Some people I spoke with who live near Liberty Park tell me they're excited about the developments coming here, but others say the city could have been spending the money elsewhere. In a unanimous vote, the Memphis City Council will be moving forward with developments in Liberty Park. The project will have a 30-year ground lease with multiple 10-year renewal options. Most people already know the city's going to do what the city's going to do, you know, sometimes regardless what the taxpayer wants. The developments include a family entertainment complex, an apartment complex, which will span across two buildings and have 200 units, and a 150-room hotel to be built at the intersection of Maxwell and Central Avenue. The city of Memphis is investing $13 million, and the developer for the project will handle the rest of the bill, totaling in at $112 million. It's an idea Marion Pigney, who has lived near Liberty Park for 17 years, says is long overdue. I was actually living here when Liberty Land was there, uh, and even after that. So I was here when they had the Frisbee golf course. Uh, I've seen the incorporation of the dog park. Memphis City Council member Jerry Green says they've done their due diligence, making sure they include stakeholders. She says the community developments will benefit the city's bottom line, not to mention increased sales tax. I think what you see reflected is our comfort level that all due diligence has been done. And so now we're going to be optimistic that it generates income for the city of Memphis. Construction on the three development projects is set to begin sometime next year. We're not sure of a tentative date and when the city of Memphis will be breaking ground here. Green does tell me that once these tax dollars start rolling in, they will be reinvesting that money back into the neighboring areas of Liberty Park. Live at Liberty Park, I'm Desmond Nugent.